Somalians mostly they elect in tribal lines. Once uh, leaders have been elected in tribal lines, at long last bring uh, conflict of interest. It is affected through uh, uh, attack. There's so many crashes, uh, conflicts, so many things. Somalia, there's a lot of uh, forces going around Kenya borders. We don't know how those are called. They say S uh, SDNA. Every time and then they cross here, they go to Mandera side and uh, the, the people of pastors living in Mandera area of Arabia and, and Elwak. Uh, some of my friends, I even ask them, is they, are, they are having a lot of problem. Uh, the, the, the real people, who, the, the residents who are living in Gedola, the political temperature is alarming, therefore people are not even comfortable as it was. But one thing that is of general understanding is that if there's peaceful elections in that place, then we will get peace because we border here, yeah? then we, will have, we don't have problems at the cross border. But should there be problems with the elections there, definitely it will just come to this big, vast, porous border, which will also affect us. And there's some incursions. So insecurity there yes, now brings insecurity influx to us. As far as I know, the Jubaland uh, state has not uh, submitted the committee for elections, which was supposed to bring up the, the MPs from Jubaland, that was supposed to represent Jubaland in the federal chamber. The extension, in a way, and you know, Jubaland uh, has got a very long border with Kenya. Whereas in Gedo, we have only seven kilometer border with Jubaland in the entire Somalia. So there's forces from the federal government and forces from the Jubaland state who are both there. And in fact, that is a worry now.